summer solstice in Outlander, who traveled through the stones. In the Outlander novels, traveling through the stones is only possible on special days of the year. The summer solstice is one of those days and here's a look at the special travelers. While the Outlander TV series has overlooked the importance of certain days of the year, the novels continue the idea that the stones only allow time travel on specific pagan days. The summer solstice is one of those. That means today is the day to travel if you're in Scotland, or at another time travel location, right now. There are two people who travel through the stones on summer solstice, one in 1971 and one in 1781. Caution. There are spoilers in this post for those who haven't read all the books yet. Here's a look at the travelers on this day in the Outlander series. The 1971 Traveler It shouldn't take too much guessing on who travels through the stones on summer solstice in 1971. This is also a story that should come up in Outlander Season 4, hopefully with the timing remaining the same although that certainly hasn't been the case in previous seasons, so you never know. Yes. It's Roger Wakefield Mackenzie who makes the trip through the stones for the very first time. Finding out that Brianna has headed to the past, Roger goes after her. They initially catch up with each other, but then separate and it all goes wrong from there for a short period of time, with Roger wrongfully accused of rape. The 1781 Traveler The second travel turns out to be a Mackenzie ancestor of Roger. William Buckley Mackenzie. He is also the illegitimate sons of Gaelis Duncan and Dougal Mackenzie, raised by a family in Scotland. He travels through the stones accidentally and finds himself in the 20th century having to find his bearings to survive. Fortunately, he eventually runs into Roger and Brianna, who happened to be at Lollybrock at the time. This gives him some familiar faces to help him navigate the new world as he decides it may not be best to return to the past. 